Well, today's conference was the, um, is a result of the creation of the Sustainable Cities Club last year, created by the French team in South Africa, so the French uh, embassy, Business France, uh, who we, I represent today, and also the French Development Agency. So this club had the goal of bringing together French companies with the, you know, the, the objective of promoting French expertise in terms of sustainable city models um, and uh, obviously engaging with the South African counterparts to kind of promote the concept of sustainability models and you know, we, we, we are really influenced by what has been done in France as well in terms of, of, of a push, a general push towards sustainable city models where you, you see that we have installed politics uh, such as enabling acts and also uh, uh, demonstrate the projects with eco cities and, and, and eco, eco districts that have actually provided us with a platform from which to, uh, to, to share our experiences with South African counterparts. So this is something we're trying to, to focus on at the moment. Um, and we can also, uh, the goal for us is also to learn from what can be done in South Africa in terms of creating inclusive and integrated sustainable city models. Uh, so that's one of our priority areas. Uh, I think we've all been uh, quite alarmed by the recent IPCC report as well, uh, highlighting the great, 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 great priority that is the decarbonation of the world economy. And together, I think we can achieve something along those lines. I mean, that was really the gist of the creation of this South African uh, this Sustainable City Conference. This Business France is, a, is an agency. We are a national agency, we're not a company. And, and our role is really to, to promote French businesses internationally. So we have this one-sided role where we help French businesses develop internationally and this other role where we promote France's image as an attractive investment destination. So we play these two roles and in between organize events such as the Sustainable City Conference and uh, try to promote the agenda set out by the Paris Agreement in 2015 as well by organizing conferences like this. Uh, the, the, the four main components of this conference are uh, in a way what we would like to, to enable access to for everyone which are affordable services in terms of water, energy, housing and transport. So that is today's big focus, uh, all the while knowing that there is a big link with unemployment and poverty. So we are trying to get South Africans and French stakeholders to put together the fact that you cannot build a sustainable city model without enhancing the livelihoods of people who live in those cities. And that is a result of obviously working on the whole poverty and inequality uh, alleviation. Uh, well, over the past, the course of the past few years, we've noticed a lot of projects spring up, uh, a lot of cooperation projects spring up between France and South Africa. And what we find is that we are able to reach agreements and partnerships on all sectors pertaining to sustainable cities. So, as, as a few examples, um, our French electrician EDF, which is basically the French uh, ESCOM, has worked with the Nelson Mandela Bay Metropolitan Municipality to analyze their uh, low voltage distribution network and renovate this network. This is one example of a project that was financed uh, through French funds, which is called a FAZEP, which is a French funding mechanism for such projects. Uh, on a similar actually, uh, example in the water and sanitation, um, a French company installed a uh, desalination plant in the municipality of Hesequa in the Western Cape. So we find that we are present in all these, in all these very important sectors. And finally, transport is a very, very big topic for us as well. And uh, the AFD, the French Development Agency, has worked uh, with the city of Johannesburg to fund the, uh, um, a project on uh, what you call TOD, transit-oriented development, um, called the Corridor of Freedom. So Polytech is a, one of the world's leading environment and energy shows, trade shows. Uh, it attracts over 70,000 visitors every two years in Lyon in France. And uh, this year, from the 27th to the 30th of November, will be the 28th anniversary of this show. So what we're trying to do is to further the discussion we'll have today between the French and South African stakeholders, to actually carry this discussion further at the conference in, in Lyon in France later this month, where the sustainable city topic will actually be an important one as well.